What's happening folks and welcome to another episode of Stars of Tomorrow, an FM20 series where we look at some of the young town on Foot Manager and we see how the game simulates their progress in these videos. So, um, today's player is Daniel Braca Bracana, Braca Brag whatever. <laughs> these names guys, give me some easy names, Jesus. Um, so yeah, if you've got a player you want to look at guys, feel free in the comments section to leave his name and as much info as you can. But also don't forget to check out the playlist and make sure it's not been done already. So I'm going to just talk about um, some of the, the format of the series going for. Format of the series. A lot of people are saying I should be um, do, do it differently and make sure they get played. The problem is, if I was to put all these guys into a team and then get them played, it would take. It would still. It would take a long time to guarantee. The only way I can guarantee they get they get played football is if I um, were to take control of the team themselves and make sure they're played. And that would take way too long to get through. Or it would mean using um, editors and simulating and not having. You know what I mean? It would be too much alterations into the save. And the database to really do it. I'm, I'm guessing being game made as a way to you can just sim and not get sacked or anything like that. I don't use it, so I don't know. But again, it would it would take too long to simulate and make sure that they're getting played and restarting. So I get the point, but there's time restraints on this, like unfortunately. Um, and yeah, I'd love I'd love to find a way of doing it as quick and easy. But every idea I've thought about of trying to make sure these guys get regular football is still very time consuming. And also, um, there's no guarantee that no matter how, many how often they get played, they will become amazing. Um, so, again, I've got to balance that between getting the videos done for you guys, but also, again, we've got to try and make sure that they're good quality. But, yeah, it, it, all those things, like I can't sit here all day with one player restarting, 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 restarting because at the end of the day I won't get anything else done and that's the upshot of it unfortunately so yeah, um, we can stick with this format right now but if anyone's got a really quick idea of where I can just do it feel free in the comments but the idea that one comment either I put them on one team or restarting all the time the, I've got to balance it out and realise that there's other safe people like to watch and I've got the second channel on Twitch and work and other things and it, I can't just on my time just not go on this one series so I just want to address that I'm aware these news that always come out turn out amazing but that's what manager for you that's the way it is um, and that's unfortunate if I had unlimited time and this was my job I'd be able to maybe do that yes but what I might start doing is, is if it doesn't work out the first one through do a second one max two so if, I, if I'll say I did two run throughs this is the second one and this is the rest it turned out then we'll go. I mean, I may, I may, I may, I may do that, but I can't be making sure every player looks amazing every time because there's no guarantee they will be. So yeah. So Daniel, what's it? What is it? What is it? He's a DM and a CM. He's got 15 passing, 14 technique, and um, everything else is basically well-rounded. He's definitely a DM playmaker for sure. On loan at Estoril from Sporting. There is a lease clause in a sporting contract of £39 million. So, yeah, um, player traits, he's got one which is to take tempo. Let's go forward, guys, to the first jump and see how he gets on. So, guys, he's back at sporting, he's worth £6 million, and he's basically rounded out the same way, to be honest. Um, good passing, good technique, vision, not bad. So, a decent all rounded player that is pretty good. So, injury, record, let's have a look pretty okay with that I'm quite happy with how he's got on here his career starts so he's on loan a couple of times obviously then he got five goals three assists in that first season came back didn't play much that year at all didn't play much that year at all wow okay this is interesting so going forward guys the next two or three reviews I've done are basically just one run through what I'm going to start doing is doing the two run throughs if needed if they don't turn out amazing i'll do a, i'll i'll restart the database start fresh and go again 
I'm not doing more than two run-throughs for the simple reason being that it would take too long to keep doing it and doing it. To, you know, so I think two run-throughs is enough for my time, time skill. So yeah, not been played a lot, but maybe that will change in the near future. What's this cause it still hasn't got any. Let's go guys, another jump. So folks, now 28 years old and you can see here he is still at sporting. 15 passing is the main increase on his in ability here. Um, so as you can see, looking pretty damn good if I'm honest with you. I'm liking how he's developing. Um, and yeah, I think he's a very simple player. Again, so look at his injury record. Mixed, not too bad to be honest with you. So let's have a look at Punk is buzzing. Um, so yeah, as you can see here, this is a prime example, right? Just not getting played at all. So um, from I'm going to redo my next few reviews. I'm going to what I'm thinking of doing, folks. Actually, now looking at this, I've not. See, I, don't, I don't look at these. I just look at the age and the short to make sure they've upgraded to the age I want to view them at. Then I jump into a surprise. It's a surprise to me as well. Going forward, I may take a longer to get these videos out. And I'm going to make the FM Monaco series daily. For the simple reason is I want to take more time in these videos. Make sure they look really, really good. Um, now, obviously, if they... I'm going to try and make it every other day. But we'll have to wait and see. Depends how the reviews go. There's no real time scale in this series now. So, yeah. I'm going to do a video explaining that. Obviously, already. So, do no, do no jump, guys. I don't think it's about that much. It's not looking now. So guys, who to Slavia Prague, and he's now 32 years old, and he's basically ended up like we thought he was at the start, and basically how it started off. So look at his injury record, again, not too bad. Um, Stats-wise, again, Sporting didn't play him, unfortunately, and that's the problem. 6-1-1, uh, one and 5-3, one, and, and then 9-7. and seven. When he does play, he just seems to get the, get the result, get the performances and goals and assists. So... We are going to, from now on, do two run-throughs maximum on a player. Hopefully they develop. If they don't get up to two run-throughs, that is essentially uh, what we're going to be doing. So I'm going to do a video, literally I've done this one, talk about that on YouTube right now. So yeah, I will see you next week. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy the video. I hope you have hit the like button down below. Subscribe if you are new. See you next time. Bye-bye.